Good morning. Welcome to the final meeting of the County Board of the Free Open. Uh, we're going to begin, as always, uh, well, first of all, I should mention we're not going to begin with a conference agenda. So although they're all late starters, we're not still uh, asking for those uh, when we reach the consent agenda. Okay, uh, sure. And I assume there's no reason to go into the second session. No reason to go into the second session. So with that, let's begin uh, with the announcement of the news law and roll, roll call. Ladies and gentlemen, the notice requirement of open public meetings law has been satisfied with respect to this meeting. Specifying the time, date, location, including the annual notice adopted the reorganization meeting, filed with the county clerk, posted in the administration building, and mailed to two newspapers in accordance with the provisions of the law. Freeholders Opter, Best, here. Duffy, James, here. Lepore, here. Deputy Director Lazara, here. Director Bartlett, here. Please rise for. O oh God, who provides for thy people by thy power and rules over them in love, be gracious enough to bless thy servants, our freeholders in the county of Visay, that thy people may dwell in peace and safety through our Lord. Amen. Good enough. Good enough. Let me enter to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for one forever, all very secure, very lucky, 
and I think that our two committee feels the same that we have a mayor uh, and a sheriff's office that is very tuned, uh, that does not need to be asked, that's already there. Honestly, this has been there, and uh, I hope and pray that we never have anything like what we've seen in other places. But uh, um, if we do, I know our sheriff's office uh, is prepared. So I thank that. And I also want to second what Deputy Director said as far as our county employees, our department heads, everybody. Um, you know, our county employees, um, quite honestly, you know, all, all, all the people, government and the people who support government and work for government, unfortunately, get a bad name. You're underpaid and underrecognized, but I want to say thank you uh, for everything you do for the year um, and uh, that you do support the residents of this county. So, hope you have a happy year. Great year, everybody. Okay. I just got to say Happy New Year to everybody. Uh, I'll reiterate everything you said today and uh, the rest of the set. Um, we missed something on one of our meetings. And by the way, I, I think the world of all of the art department has the best uh, in the state and uh, the country. Uh, we're we're going to be making some appointments that absolutely thrill me, but I'll let somebody else uh, talk about that later. <coughs> Miss Bridge Cato, who we reappointed to his uh, 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 term as our uh, CFO, and I'm sorry that we forgot to mention that at one of our last meetings, but <laughs> around, we've lived for years with other folks in that office. You are a godsend, and we really appreciate everything you do for all of us. You really work. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Director. Um, hope everybody had a nice Christmas and a happy Hanukkah. Uh, wishing everyone a happy new year. Um, in light of some of the comments made here about uh, our, I want to join them, and our department heads are the best. Um, we function the way we do because of your due diligence and your commitment to the county. Um, but I want to highlight in the times that we live in, I want to thank our police director, Bobby Lyons, who trains our law enforcement across the area. Uh, and thanks to him and his leadership, we have well-trained law enforcement personnel, um, and I appreciate that. And finally, um, Director, uh, I want to echo what everyone has said. You did a great job this year. I told you well. Thank you. <laughs>
to January 1st, 2021 for a total premium of $402,382. The next one, that being L79, is a resolution ratifying the memorandum of agreement between the County of Passaic and Local 1032 of Communication Workers of America, representing security guards at Preckness Healthcare Center for a period commencing January 1st, 2020, and terminating December 31st, 2023. Third late starter, that being L80, is a resolution authorizing the purchase of software, hardware, and maintenance with MRA International in the amount of $11,737.60 for the using agency, that being MIS. The fourth resolution as a late starter is going to be L81, resolution authorizing state and cooperative purchases for all state county departments with regard to various purchases of goods and services. And last is L82, resolution authorizing the purchase of software, hardware, and maintenance agreements for the superintendent of elections in the amount of $21,804. That's all I have, Mr. Director. Thank you very much. Can I have a motion to add a lead start? Second. Second by Lazare. Yes. Fiona Opter? Yes. Best? Yes. James? Yes. Before? Yes. Deputy Director Lazare? Yes. Director Bartlett? Yes. Can I have a motion to adopt the consent agenda L12 L82? Second. Free holder Opter? Yes. Best? Uh, yes, I'll accuse myself from uh, L39. James? Yes. Lepore? Yes. Deputy Director Lazare? Yes. Director Bartlett? Yes. Uh, I have a couple things to say about you. Just for the record, the uh, director there's a minor correction on page 13 uh comment section uh to mountain's retirement is uh, january 1st 2024. just a typo very good so with that in mind do i have a motion on personnel and personnel second free all this doctor yes that's yes James, yes. before, yes. Deputy Director Lazar, yes. Director Bartlett, yes. I have a motion on the bill. Second. Three holders, Opter, yes. Best, yes. James, yes. Before, yes. Deputy Director Lazar, yes. Director Bartlett, yes. So with our adoption of the consent agenda and the personnel agenda, we made two very important changes here at Passaic County. And I want to congratulate Matthew Jordan, our new county council. experience over the last three or four years as deputy county administrator, I think along with your legal uh, background, really equip you well for that position. And I'm looking forward to more great things. You've been somebody who leans forward on a lot of the initiatives that our county uh, accomplishes, and uh, I know that that's going to continue to be the case, so congratulations. Um, and we are filling the gaping hole in the administrator's office with uh, an exceptionally accomplished young woman. Congratulations, Kelly Rafael. Our new deputy. <laughs> Kelly, you're someone else who, uh, since you came on uh, in what was then a newly created position uh, in cultural and historic affairs, uh, really have you know transformed and expanded what we do in our parks and historic sites in remarkable ways and that kind of initiative uh, and what I've seen uh, sitting with you on the boards of Friends of Passaic County Parks and Friends of Dye Mansion uh, tells me that uh, we're going to continue to get that kind of uh, overachievement and uh, outperformance in your new role and I congratulate you and it's always good to have more redheads in leadership. <laughs> uh, so with that, does anyone want to add anything else before? Uh, uh, yes, Director. We always seem to why we seem to Okay, we can go to the next one, the top, uh, the fourth one, the way it does, the 
If I may, um, so I usually don't, uh, I'm not very good at goodbyes, but in Matthew's case, it's good riddance. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> my longest serving uh, deputy, deputy administrator, no, I'm kidding. Um, but he, had, he is my longest serving deputy administrator. I'm not sure what that says about me or what that says about him, but I'll leave that up to everybody else. But um, thankfully, he's not going far. Um, Matt and I have developed a, a great working relationship and personal relationship. And uh, I know he's going to do a great job as county council, and I look forward to it, Matt. Thank you for uh, making me look good. Kelly, boy, you're in for it. Um, <laughs> I, I mean, since I've had this conversation with her, I feel like she is a deer in the headlights. Um, but Kelly is going to do a great job in, in the short time that she has been in this county. And she has been very impactful on creating a department, as the director said. Um, and, and, and everything has gone so, so well. And I know that, that this is a great opportunity for, for her career and for her future. Uh, and I hope, that, uh, I hope that she can tolerate me uh, but as I tell everybody, I like to surround myself by smart people because smart people make me look smart. Um, and Kelly truly is a rising star here. But honestly, all the department heads that, uh, that we have in Passaic County um, really help us all to do our jobs. And I thank each and every one of you. Uh, and on to, the next, uh, on to the next step. So congratulations, Matt. Congratulations, Kelly. And thank you to the rest of you for everything that you do day in and day out. Uh, for the citizens of Passaic County. Uh, and for those freeholders who don't recognize uh, these three ladies uh, sitting here in front of you, um, Sarah uh, just was awarded uh, the equestrian bid on the agenda today. So <laughs> Sarah took over uh, the, the stables how many years ago? Uh, eight. eight years ago. Um, and for those who were on this board prior to Sarah taking over, it was um, always rough. Um, whoever operated those stables, uh, for whatever reason, uh, we either had complaints from boarders, um, and since Sarah has taken over, honestly, she has done a fantastic job. We get no complaints. In fact, Sarah, um, we, we received many, many a, a, an email um, hoping that you would be selected as, as the vendor moving forward and I, clearly there was two vendors you came out on top and we look forward to a continued relationship and the, and the job that you do and I know that um, these next however long that bid is for uh, that we're going to continue to see the progress that you've made up there and thank you very much thank you thank you Anthony I, I join you uh, for a little poor in thanking Lewis and Hoff uh, our uh, clerk to the board for an exceptional year and for many years of great service. Uh, also, our entire team in this office, Lisa and Marquisha and uh, Jasmine, uh, make this make this operation run. And as you said, Anthony, surround yourself with uh, qualified, accomplished people, and they can make almost anyone look good. Uh, and that is certainly the case here with uh, with our team in the Freelover's office and with our entire team that I see sitting out here of all the departmental leadership. And with that, 2019 is in the books. And I'll take a look at Lucha. Freelover's up there? Yes. Bass? Yes. James? Before? Yes. Deputy Director Lazar? Yes. Director Bartlett? Yes. Thank you, everyone. Happy New Year. Thank you. Thank you.